okay, I got that one, that one, that one's piston and the block and stuff. Another piston in case I screw up the first one. And lost foam. And yes, that is a propane tank. This thing roars. one piston in it, block, an extra T-nut, and that one, I have no idea how it's going to turn out because I've never done, never actually had much luck with uh, lost foam, so we're giving it a try. That's my old junk oil bonded sand that was no good, had dried out too much from being used so much. This thing is a beast. Had a little sputtering when it started, but it, as soon as it, I got it dialed in, it doesn't use much gas at all, and it just roared. Got to put the crucible in now, and I should be good to go. We set this up. I'll come back. Yeah, this is my try of lost phone. I couldn't see anything because it just turned up into a giant ball of flames. This was my old oil bonded sand and it. it was garbage. I used it so much that the oil got burned out of it. It was just black as all it was. So, there's two left and I'm calling it quits. Yeah, had almost 25 bucks again to refill that thing. It's not gonna use, get used very often. But it works pretty good right now. The thing's glowing really orange in there. It's not even showing it. Okay.
all done. I should put the lid on so it stop flaming. It's a little toasty. Go with the propane here and shut it off. We are done. See how it comes out in about an hour or so. Some of those pieces are pretty thick. Okay, the last ones over there were poured with the A413, the high silicon, because they're mainly pistons and a manifold that needs high strength. And a T nut, because I cast them every time I cast, so yeah. Okay. Also, I decided this is probably going to be the last time for propane. I do not like propane. It took for freaking ever to melt. It took probably 5-10 minutes for it to melt every time I put ingots in. Whereas the oil burner, it's every 2-3 minutes. Sometimes if I crack it up a little bit more, it melts those ingots that are 4-5 pound ingots it melts them as fast as I can put them in there. So, yeah, um, those ones there took probably 15 minutes to melt for two of them. So, I think I'm going to stick with oil. It's much easier, or it's not easier to light, but to run and stuff, it's much easier. Because you just hit the valve for the oil, turn it off, hit the valve, turn it back on, and you're good to go much less hassle. Also you don't get burnt as much with the oil because you can turn it on and off real fast. And since I only have a needle valve on mine, it's kind of hard to set it exactly where I need it to be. I didn't put a ball valve in because I didn't have one. But that's my opinion. I like oil better. Oh yeah, I'll come back when it's time to pull those out about an hour or so. Okay. okay. Let's see how these turned out. Brought this in before the flasks this time. Oh, this is one of the pistons, a block, a 2x4 block, and the T nut. Turned out okay. No shrinkage as far as I see. T nut looks good. Uh, toss that out there. Oops. Didn't toss, just landed on the floor. Then bounced out the door. That one looks good. No real flashing on it either. Just tiny, tiny little bit right there where this. This animal broke. And we got one more piston to do, which is right here. One of these days I'm going to take an angle right to the bottom of this flask. There's a screw sticking out and it keeps scratching up everything.
like any real flashing either, it's just nice mold. Let's go out there. Break up a few of the big chunks and then close back up and next time I add a little more water to it and it'll be good to go. Now for the big one. It goes in a separate bucket though. It doesn't go in here. It goes it actually is a different type of sand that I don't want to get mixed into here. So let's go see how it turned out. Okay, let's see how this works. It's probably really hot still. as expected. I think it could be salvaged because it's way too thick anyhow and I was going to grind most of it off to get it cleaned up. My try with lost foam. It, I guess it worked just a lot of yeah nasty. Now to go in and try cut all of it off and grind it off. Fun fun. That thing actually worked pretty good. Yeah, I'm not a fan of how long it takes to melt stuff, but it did work pretty well, so that's a plus. Everything's finally shut down and ready to go for the night. Uh, I'll shut this down. See what I can do. Okay.